Getting out of debt, it's at top of mind for many of us, and especially right now with the whole coronavirus thing going on. Well, Panda Law Firm, they are stepping up to make sure they do what's right for you and to make sure they can help you get out of debt. When this is all said and done, Judas Akalik is here. He's here with Panda Law Firm. Good morning, sir. Good morning. Whew. Strange times we're it's, living in. Man, wow, it's, a, it's, it's craziness. Uh, obviously, we're, we're, we're discussing behind the scenes the fact, you know, when the casinos close for an hour, Right. It's like, why are they closing for an hour? For 30 days. At is least. A, is a big, exactly, at least. For a big, this is a, this is a big deal. And a lot of people are going to be financially pinched by this. So yeah. the question is, you know, what do you do? What's a priority right now as far as the hierarchy of what gets paid when? Because not a lot of people have a lot of money to be thrown around right now. Look, I think the last time we kind of dealt with this as Vegas was really during 2008, right? Yeah. And we kind of got a taste of what this might be like. Yeah. And that's when we started Panda Law Firm during that time to help people through that. Um, and so what we really did was we helped people strategize on what to pay and what not to pay. Yeah. Of course, essentials, food, water, shelter, those are all very important. Yeah. I know a lot of clients are talking to their landlords about getting some kind of hiatus on rent. Yeah. Um, I think it's important if you can contact your mortgage company about your mortgage, ask them for a 90 day hiatus yeah. on paying the mortgage, um, no interest, no penalties. Yeah. Um, you can do the same thing with car companies. You can do the same thing with credit card companies. And because they're getting uh, paid, you know, they're getting some kind of bailout from yeah. the government right now. Um, I think they're more inclined to do that. They understand they're going to get their money on the back end. What they need to do is help people in, the short, in the short term. Exactly. In the short term, exactly. Uh, you saw a country like Italy, they actually stopped mortgage payments for a bit there. I, I don't know if that's coming down the pike here federally. I, I don't know if it's coming. Yeah. Um, I, I think there needs to be some kind of relief because $1,000 a month, if that's what the government is going to do, is not going to help people pay their mortgage. And actually, what I, the, the, the rumors I was hearing, it wasn't $1,000 a month. It was just one $1,000 oh. check. Yeah. Even Which, worse. You know, that <laughs> I'm might, proposing $1,000 a month. That's a couple trips maybe to your local grocery <laughs> right. store at this point, but that's about it. Yeah. Uh, I mean, you've been helping people uh, in debt for a while now. I think there's going to be a lot of people coming out of this that are going to have a mountain of it behind them. What, what, what can you do in that in that sense? I think there's a, there's a point where, where people just feel this sense of hopelessness. Yeah. It's like, wow, I got this anvil on me now. What, what do I do? It was small. Now it's huge. What do you do in this case? And I think that's where lawyers are really important or objective advisors, because yeah. when we're in the thick of it, it's hard for us to see, you know, what to do and what not to do. We're just overwhelmed, yeah. right? Um, so we're taking appointments over the phone. Mm -hmm. We're taking video conference appointments at this point um, for any new clients who have questions and for any existing clients who have questions about how to manage this time. Yeah. Um, and it's really important just to focus on what we need right now. Uh, the debt that's going to accumulate because you're not getting the income you had and you still have a lot of the same expenses, we can handle afterwards. Either we'll handle it through a bankruptcy. A lot of people who didn't qualify for a Chapter 7 bankruptcy will qualify after you know we're past all this because their income is lower. And that'll discharge all, a lot of the debt, if not all of it. Yeah. And so what people really need to focus on is just getting through the times right now and um, trying to focus on... The essentials, like I said, the food, the water, the shelter. No question. And I, I like the fact that you're doing the, uh, the, the uh, remote uh, meetings. You can do right. a video conferencing and stuff like that because, frankly, we all just got to stay home. <laughs> really, this but, is the whole point. This is why they're trying to shut everything down. They're making life boring enough where you just decide to stay home. That's it. That's what we that's need it. to do. And unfortunately, you know, sometimes we can just think about all our problems if we're at home. And that's why we want to provide that outlet for people to ask questions so we can give them advice and help them work through some of this anxiety that they're going to be feeling. There's a ton of anxiety. And I think there's, there's people that feel when that debt hits them, there's kind of like the scarlet letter on them. Yeah. A lot of people are going to be wearing that fake, you know, faux letter. That letter doesn't really exist. It right doesn't now. exist. Yeah. I mean, bankruptcies were up uh, over 300% during the 2008 economic crisis. Yeah. Um, we help people through that. We, uh, we have a credit rebuild program where we'll get people back up to at least a 700, although yeah. a lot of people get up to 800 credit score within Great. two years after a bankruptcy. Awesome. You're going to be very credit worthy. We're going to get you through this just like we helped get you through it in 2008. It's just we just have to be calm right now. You saw it in 2008 and people were trying to cling on to homes that were way uh, upside down or their debt and they were trying to work through it and they were just drowning in it. I think this is a time to realize that, you know what, there's life after perhaps a bankruptcy or there's life after being able to settle your debts to be able to get back to normal, which is good. And that's what everyone wants to be able to do. So right. uh, if you have any questions about getting out, Judy's your guy. Yeah. It's great to have you. Thanks, Sean. Thank you Take so care. much. Get out of debt with help from Panda Law Firm. And if you want to know more about them, they're located at Rainbow and Patrick in the Southwest. But you don't even need to know that. Frankly, just call them and they'll set you up with a video conference. The website's right there on your screen as well. Panda Law Firm, a proud sponsor of The Morning Blend.